Greetings and salutations, my esteemed guests and subscribers. This is none other than Lightliger here, and today I will be doing a sponsored review on Divi's mobile wallet that is currently on beta. And also, we're going to be doing a Divi giveaway in the end of this video, so make sure you're going to be sticking around till the end in order to know how to enter into this contest. But let's actually get jumped into the actual wallet. So reminder, this is a beta product and not the finalized version of DB Wallet. So right off the bat, we have two ways to basically log into the platform. We can either use a pin code here or we can use a fingerprint, which I've been absolutely in love with as of late because I realized like how convenient and how secure way that is basically to log in uh, to any platform on your phone. And this is the uh, main interface or the main page of the actual wallet. We have obviously a couple of coins supported here as of right now. First of all, we obviously have Divi, which I've done a full review on. I'm going to be linking that in the corner, which gives you a good rundown. What are the benefits of Divi as a project, what they're trying to do, and what is the basically the investment opportunity. At uh, top of that, we also have three other coins here. We have Bitcoin, obviously very important. Ethereum and also Litecoin. All of these coins have multiple different pairings on multiple exchanges and they are basically the best uh, possible coins to have on a wallet because those are the ones they're going to be using most since most trading pairs use those three coins. Uh, so one of the cool features about the actual uh, mobile wallet is that there's also a staking uh, vault that you can basically use on the actual application. You can set up a masternode here as well in case you're interested to do that. So you don't need to download the desktop wallet. Everything can be handled on mobile. That's what I've been saying with a lot of these older coins that if you don't have a mobile support in 2021, you might as well quit. I mean, it's important to have mobile phones. Most people have them. Not all people have laptops or PCs all around, especially in the third world, mobile phones are a lot more common. So that's something that people need. And that is a very nice feature. Um, so basically you can just take it there and you don't need to worry about a single thing. Uh, there's also an exchange and top up uh, commands that you can basically use in the future. So um, there's obviously the, more, uh, the actual credit card that they are working on or basically a debit card uh, that is gonna be uh, the, available in the future. And then there's obviously receive and send tab. So you can basically choose, okay, I'm gonna be receiving some Divi here. Very nice QR code and coloring here, very clean. So I can share the QR code or I can share the basic address here. Um, I can also generate new addresses in case I feel that there was not uh, enough level of privacy for my wallet. That is very convenient. And basically that is also applying for Bitcoin as well. So I can just generate more addresses as I please. Then uh, there's obviously the ability to use a send, but I will also choose a select recipient. And there can be many ways to basically search uh, for a recipient. So I can actually, you know, type in somebody's name or username. Actually, I'm going to be showing you that. So one of the cool things you can do in the wallet is, in order to basically make things a lot more easier to send stuff is to actually use um, a search system first, first of all, that's what you're seeing there. Basically, um, when you go into the settings, first of all, you can have your own avatar here, but also I can add an actual username. So I can receive a money through my username here. And I don't need to use like the long string addresses. I can also receive through phone and email as well. And those are things that you can basically verify. You can also choose which of these informations are basically going to be available. Are people able to, um, we can go into the actual settings and choose privacy. So here we can basically choose, am I going to be displaying my full name? Am I going to be displaying my username and profile picture? And if people have the ability to know your email already or phone number, basically you can set it up so that people can basically search out your email or phone number and send money through that way. So it's a very convenient way to receive and send a payments because it makes it everything so streamlined and easy. As I already discussed, there's always the pin number here, which is another uh, ability for you to uh, access uh, more security on your phone. And obviously we have the touch ID, which we already discussed. 
Also in the local currency, you can choose into pretty much any currency in the world. So in case you wanna just see that balances in your local currency or another one, it's pretty easy to do. On the more options, we also have display percentage change. That's a nice feature, display local currency. And then we have also DV play, which is currently on the test environment. And then we have the backup phrase, which I'm obviously not gonna be showing to you guys as of right now. Uh, then we have like the favorites tab and here I can just store like email addresses if I so desire. And also there's an invite tab, not a referral program as of right now. So you know, will be not benefiting from that. And so there is a lot of like benefit in the, this wallet. It's very easy to use. The sending is very, you know, as I said, streamlined and easy. And then there's going to be a currency exchange in the future. So you can swap fiat to crypto, crypto to crypto. So I can swap my Divi into Ethereum and vice versa. And there's obviously staking here available. So you're going to be just accessing your Divi very easily. You don't need to get to the desktop wallet. You can do basically everything uh, right here inside on the mobile wallet. Not exactly like able to sign messages, but that might be something that they might implement in the future. And now to show up really quickly how easy it is to actually deploy the masternode within the mobile wallet. So you're gonna be hitting the earn button and then you're just gonna be clicking new Divi node. Then you're gonna be choosing the tier. Obviously we're gonna be choosing the best possible, which is silver right now. And here you can basically see the monthly rewards, the yearly rewards, what is the frequency between those rewards and all of this important percentage data and you know the amount of dollars and everything that you basically need to know in order to understand better about your investment. Then we're just gonna be clicking start Divi node and the subscription cost with not zero dollars as of right now, continue. And I can also put up a name here. I'm just gonna be putting something random, continue and confirm payment. And voila, basically after that, we have a set up our own masternode within the mobile wallet. And it is not really that <laughs> hard to do. Anybody can basically uh, get it and it's now been successfully deployed. Uh, that is how easy it is basically to set up your own masternode within the mobile wallet. Now, how am I able to basically enter to this contest that I was talking about? So I will be giving out 10,000 Divi here and basically that is over $500 worth of money and I'm going to be in 20 people uh, around $25 worth of Divi so 500 Divi each and basically what you need to do is to enter the make it song so once you're going to be making it in this bull run what is going to be the celebrity song you're going to be listening what is the make it music going to be you know uh, playing in your new Lambo or something like that and so put up the actual artist name and then the song and then below you're going to be adding your Divi address. Uh, a couple of other rules, you must like the video as well and also you can't use a song that has already been taken on the list and I will be choosing the best songs if you're going to be picking out shitty songs, well you're not going to be winning so I mean there's that but um, this contest is going to be going around for some time depends on how many entries we're going to be getting and I will be sending Divi to you obviously you have multiple places where you can store Divi couple of exchange options which I'm going to list down below in the description you also have stack of stake which I reviewed not too long ago where you can store your Divi and get them staking or you can also uh, download the desktop wallet or but thanks for watching this video you can uh, find everything about Divi in the description down below uh, happy you know you know uh, day for you guys and I will be seeing you in the next video cheers